Hi Kindergarten, it's Mr. Samuel here. I'm going to read a picture book to you called Bamboozled by David Legg. Now this was my favourite picture book when I was in kindergarten and I think you're going to enjoy it too. Now make sure that you look at the pictures carefully as I read this book to you because the pictures tell a different story than the words. At the end you can record a video or leave a comment about what your favourite picture or part of the book was. Let's begin. Bamboozled by David Legg I love my granddad. I visit him every week. And every week, things are the same. But last week, when I arrived, something seemed... odd. Can you see anything odd in this picture? We sat down as usual and chatted for a while. Then, granddad poured the tea and we ate fresh cakes he'd baked that morning. I can see some unusual things in this picture. What can you see? We played cards, and as always, he won. We went through his old photo albums, and I listened as he told stories about the good old days. I helped him with the housework, but all the while something bothered me. We worked in the garden, and I planted bulbs in the flower bed. I pushed the wheelbarrow while Grandad pruned the roses. And still, something seemed strange. It niggled and niggled at the back of my mind. You're quiet today, Grandad said, as he fed the cat. I know, I said. I can't make it out. There's something I can't put my finger on. Something today seems... odd. Well, I've redecorated the hallway. No, I thought. It wasn't that. I've bought two new fish. No, it wasn't that either. Then, just as we were saying our goodbyes on the doorstep, it suddenly struck me. Granddad, I said. That's what it is. You're wearing odd socks. Silly granddad, we did laugh. And you can see here that the girl left her granddad's house in a duck boat. It looks like granddad's house is surrounded by a moat in the middle of a big city. Such silly pictures and such a fun book. Wasn't that fun and silly? I love that book. What was your favourite part? My favourite part was the duck that needed goggles and a floaty to swim. Isn't that silly? Make sure you comment or record a video about your favourite part. Bye for now.